Hello, and welcome to Story Writing Using Pictures, Part 2. Let's take a look at the first picture. What kind of day is it, and what can you see? It's a hot afternoon, and the sun is shining. Who can we see in this picture, and where are they? John is at May Park with his mom and dad. Then, what are they doing? They are having a picnic, but I must try and use the word they have given. So I could say, they are having a picnic, and mom brings many things like chocolate cookies, bananas, apples, and some yummy orange juice. Let's have a look at picture two. Suddenly, something happens. They get a fright. So I will start my sentence by saying, all of a sudden, a naughty monkey jumps out of the tree and onto the table. Everyone is scared of the monkey. I have tried to include more by writing how they feel. So I have mentioned what happens and then how they feel afterwards. Look at picture three. What does the monkey do? And then how do they feel? What does dad do? The naughty monkey takes the bananas and an apple and runs away. So how does dad feel and what does he do? Dad is so angry and chases the monkey to get their food back. Finally, I have to decide how the story ends. So I will begin by writing, in the end. What happens in the end? In the end, the monkey gets away and dad cannot find the monkey. In my story, I want to write something that John says. So I could write, John tells his dad, it's all right, dad. We still have lots of food to eat. Make sure you have your inverted commas and you have your comma and full stop. Then finally, let's finish our story on a happy note. For me, I am going to write, his parents both smile and they all enjoy the picnic happily together. That is the end of my story. I hope you like it. Until next time, bye-bye.